So William Floyd Collins was actually working to expand a passage in what's known as the sand cave when a boulder broke loose and landed on his foot 55 feet below. Fortunately for him though, rescuers were able to reach him, providing him food and water while their plan was to break away this top part of the rock and help remove the boulder that's still pinning his foot down. But on day four, the entrance to the cave actually collapsed. Now, rescuers could still hear Collins, but they couldn't reach him. So they had to rush to clear the debris out of the front of the cave and get back down to him. So even though rescuers could still hear and talk with Collins, they couldn't reach him. And after 10 days like that, he died of dehydration and hypothermia. They ended up making it to him, but it took an extra three days that he didn't have.